hi guys how you doing today is sunday and i just finished filming elera's morning routine i'm cooking a bonus soup a bonus soup has been long i cook a bonus soup because my husband doesn't like a bonus soup that much so i cook it once in a while i know you did not approve of this soup but i'm just going to cook it anyways there's nothing he's gonna do he's gonna have to eat it Lera is not supposed to be here, but she was dragging my tripod. Anytime I'm making a video and she's just around on the floor, she'll be dragging my tripod. I don't know what she wants. Lera, what do you want when you drag my tripod? What do you want? I'm cooking this up bono with cow, cow leg and fish. I realize that I don't have any goat meat in my freezer anymore. The only thing in my fridge that is just cow leg, cow leg, cow leg. So many cow legs, bags of cow legs. So for these past few weeks, I've been using cow legs to cook. I just want to finish all the meat in the freezer so that I can buy another set of meat and stock in the freezer. I usually buy goat meat, cow leg, and chicken. That's how I do it. I just stock it in the freezer so I know that whenever I want to cook, I, jumped, I just need to buy small small things not everything this is cooked fish i'm using cooked cooked fish i like cooking my fish some people fry i don't fry maybe until i have air fryer then i'll start frying my fish for now i just cook it before putting it in the food Guys, the heat in this country is on another level. I used to hear it's so hot, it's so hot, and I don't really know. I do not really know it's hot because in the morning I'll just wake up, prepare myself, walk from home, put on my AC, and walk. I don't really know how serious this is until I went out. I stepped out, I think from about three days ago. I went out and there is a, a problem. We all, well, our car currently have a problem. I was going to have an accident, so the car is not is in the mechanic or with the panel beater. So, like, I'm not going to talk about that now. So, I had to use KK to go out. And God, you know, there is no AC in KK now. Everywhere was so hot. Everywhere was hot. As if I was inside and pulled home. That is when I really understood that truly, truly, there is, there is. <laughs> I was when I understand that when, when people say, oh, it's so hot, sometimes my sister will call me and be like, it's so hot. Are you feeling this heat? I'll just tell her, no, I'm not feeling any heat. Right? To me, it's just normal. It's not hot. Mm -hmm. That's because I don't used to go out. So once I stepped out, that is when I realized that. And I stepped out in the afternoon. That is when I realized that, gosh. It is so hot. How is the heat in your area? Is it hot or is cold? You know, because the matan just finished, so after the matan came a lot, a lot, lot of heat. Come see. So I just made a very silly mistake because I added seasoning cubes. To the soup and i did not add salt i tested a little bit of salt and i i was like you know what I, i've not added salt before let me just add small the process of adding small that small turned out to be much so this i feel the soup is salty although if i ask my husband he will say it's not salty but to me it's very salty come and test the blessing let's see how salty it is. Is it salty? It's not salty. It's not salty. No, no my tongue my tongue is salty. It is salty. It is salty, salty. <laughs> salt. Salt. I think I'm licking salt. Ha! There's no salt inside. There's no salt. 
Jesus, how do you guys eat salt? Are you like me? Do you eat salt or... <laughs> or you just eat little salt? Um, poop. I eat little, just little because of my mom. When my mom started this small salt something in our, in our house, we were all not getting it. We are like, how can we not eat salt? The food will not be tasty without salt. It won't be tasty. But if we we'll we hide and put salt. By the time my mom tested, she was like, there's salt in this food, there's salt in this food, she won't eat it. And if you cook, my mom doesn't eat, she will not ask you, bring Gary for me, let me sip. You will not be feeling bad. Why didn't I just put small salt so that she would be able to eat? So that is how we all adjusted. And now if you give us any food with a lot of salt, we like tend to not like it because it's, we just feel salt so easily right now. The soup was too plain, so I added extra vegetable from the fridge. The vegetable leaf. So it now looks better to me. So guys, um, before we moved to this house, we, we did not have dining table before we moved to this house. So we're always eating on uh, one small table and we used to eat from one plate. So when we moved to this house, babe, why do we eat from the same plate? Because you never allow me to eat alone. <laughs> That's not true. That's not true. So when we moved to this house, we did not get a dining table on time until after some some months we got a dining months or weeks we got a dining table and we started eating the first time that i i i, I dish the food differently separately i really like us to eat together because when we eat together it kind of why are you doing like that i think we, it nice. kind of makes us share this bond of eating together I, the truth is that I eat more when I eat with him. So if I'm not eating with him, I tend to eat very little. So I always like to eat with him so that right. he will encourage me. Like being that I'm eating with someone, we eat together and I get I tend to eat more. And then we tend to struggle who is going to eat the bigger meat. <laughs> the <laughs> <We'll see. laughs> who will eat the bigger meat? And then there is one thing my husband does. He finish all the periwinkle because the way I was brought up, I, I eat periwinkle at the end. So it has kind of gotten so used to me that I always have to wait till the end till I eat my periwinkle. Meanwhile, my husband is a complete opposite. Sometimes I only have to eat one or two periwinkles in the food because before I could even remember there is periwinkle. He has finished 99% of it. So we are now having our obono soup with water. Water. Cold water. I don't drink cold water though. This is just for my husband. So I just drink my water directly from the dispenser. Not cold. I used to drink cold water before, but these days, if I try if I drink cold water, I tend to experience this shock on my tooth. Here, right here. Lent is not good. Cold water is not good. Cold water is not good, but you can't do without cold water. Anyways, mm, you used to do well. without cold water not still. Well. Blessings started filling the fridge with cold water. I don't say I won't die or survive. But Babe, did you pray? Yes, I did. So what made you think I don't pray for you? Too? Because you just came and you dig in. Mm, so what do you do? Do you eat with your husband when your husband is around? 
or you just eat alone i know that at some point in time i'm going to have to start eating alone maybe by the time Elira is bigger i'll have i'll start eating alone or eating with Elira. in which of the house in this house babe so let me tell you i don't want to talk while eating but when i i there's one day when the dining table arrived i dished my food separately and i dished it on its own separately and it was like when did you start eating alone is that what you said <laughs> when did you start eating alone you don't want to eat with me again right so i was like okay uh, since we now have a dining table you still want us to say okay no problem let's eat together I just kept my own aside and we ate together and that was just it. So how do you do it? Do you eat with your husband when your husband is around or you just like to eat your food alone and alone and you don't like anybody sharing with you? How do you like it? Yeah, you, you feel salt in this food. It's normal. You taste salt? No, not really. Not really. No, the salt has kind of reduced. The funny thing is my wife can actually eat anything you put inside water to bring out color as long as it um, has this, how do you call that stuff? Draw. Slime. <laughs> yeah, slimy kind of feeling. She'll eat it with, Jesus with, with swallow. Deep. But I'm not like that. That's why all this, I just eat this kind of food because I, I'm, I'm, I want to feel my tummy. But apart from that, I love leafy food. Leafy soups, yeah. But babe, what can you say that? Then the only soup I like that doesn't really have leaf is um, the white soup, a fair fairy, a kebab. And she not eat berry now, no. Yeah. That's when she start complaining. Okay, just be reminding me every mm. time. Remind me every single time to eat. Well, there's actually one day that I warn you. It was very very intentional. There's never been a competition. It was a competition, Joe. There's never been. When I eat only one per wrinkle and it eats like 50. <laughs> <laughs> the competition. really nice this was going to be the outcome Give me leafy food. I actually added um, this thing vegetable leaf because of you can you see the vegetable leaf inside hmm? the slimy nature of this food has already made me not notice any vegetable babe you say it doesn't like my food it's only okra I prefer to be slimy he doesn't like my food. How can I take so much time to cook with love? No, hmm? Am I eating with heat? You are eating with complaint. You like across or across slime. You don't like obono slime. Because I don't understand it. <laughs> How can something that doesn't have any leaf or particle bring out that slime? I don't know what I'm say. Can't you see okra? It's greenish. And then, yeah, lovely. I think it's your village kind of okay, or your, you people don't like okra, or you prefer a bun. Mm -hmm. I don't like okra. Uh, eating okra, it's, it's me, chore. I, I, was, I, was, I wasn't um, brought up eating a but I used to eat. I wasn't, okra. I wasn't brought up eating okra. Yeah. I was brought up eating okra, so I'm used to okra. Like, Everybody in my house, except my dad, don't like okra. Okay, maybe my brother likes okra, like the doctor, he likes okra. Kufre, the fish uh, farmer, fish academy, he will not even test it. He can, will not even test it. Like, they don't test it. I eat okra, but I try to avoid that, uh, the okra itself. I'll just be eating only the slime out of I the okra. I enjoy my wife's okra a whole lot. She knows how to cook it but doesn't know how to eat it well. I don't know how to eat it. Like <laughs> me? Sometimes when I'm eating, I'll just be like, yeah, let me not discourage this man from eating with the way I'm selecting. <laughs> and funny enough, that's why she doesn't get to cook it that much in the house. Mm -hmm. 
There's another one, another annoying song. She Perfect. loves so much. Very annoying. Yeah, it's so hard to. That leaf is tasteless. It's not tasteless, huh? How can you be like that? What's the taste of that leaf? Okay, what's the taste of okra? Mm. What's the taste of alfalfa? Mmm. Oh, that leaf taste. Don't worry, I'll cook it for you next time. Go for a bit. <laughs> <laughs> When she cooks it, she eats it alone. And any of her sisters that come, she they eat. eat it together. He actually made me to stop cooking that food because, just like I said, he encourages me to eat. I enjoy when I eat with him. So if I have to cook food and be the only one to eat the food, it's somehow now. So what's the essence? Last time I think... You make a small quantity now. I think I, I cooked it last time and I ended up not eating it. Because, so I'll, was it? because I will tell you, babe, let me make this soup for you. Like, no, 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 I don't want it. I don't want it. I don't want it. And he I doesn't like what I eat. And he doesn't eat fufu as well. You select too much. It smells too much. You select too much. I don't select. I love fufu. Fufu smells. If I get the one that doesn't smell, I eat. My mom's fufu doesn't smell one bit. And your mom is very far away, so we hardly get her fufu. Don't worry, we'll, we'll soon get it. My mom makes her fufu in a way that it doesn't smell. If you eat it, you think you're eating. But I eat some yam. No. You eat some mm -hmm. yam. I eat pound the yam now. And you eat, it's only my smell that you like. Mm -hmm. Apart from that, I'm good with Gary. Why do you like only my smell? You want to start finding yourself and feeling all proud? <laughs> yes, now because I'm the only person that has been able to. But you've never given me pound there, Mm-mm. I won't. I yeah. won't. <laughs> I, I won't give you pound there, yam. Where is the shoulder? I should not come and use this, my fragile shoulder. Just to tell be me you want yam. us to eat pound there, and I'll pound you it. You'll pound it. <laughs> okay, there's no mortar. The mother would have had, we've used it for black soup. <laughs> no worry, we'll buy mother. You'll pound it, then we eat pound it, yeah. You want to see it? <laughs> okay guys, let me show you what I was talking about. This is my periwinkle. I've eaten just three. Look at what he has eaten. Just three. And these three, these three that I've eaten, I've really tried because he actually reminded me. You don't come to joke. <laughs> <laughs> let's, let's manage. What is this one? This cow, cow leg. I think either cow head leg or cow head. You didn't cut it well. I can't cut it now. You have to eat it like big, big. Before you swallowed it, I don't get it. I'm supposed to show and true. Mm-hmm. Why? It's bad. Yeah. I'm a good man. Mm -hmm. Okay, man. Whoa. I said I don't want. Oh, just you know, let's take it out there. <laughs> well, let me eat this one.
Ooh. We finished the food. That brings us to the end of our unintentional mukbang. Unintentional <laughs> mukbang. Yeah, what's for you? Please like, subscribe, share, and tell me, do you share a plate of food with your husband? Or we are just weird? Do you think we are weird? Or do you think I'm weird? We're good, we're here. For eating from, this, uh, eating from the same plate. Mm. It ain't weird. That's how my parents used to eat. Yeah, I used to eat from template. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> you know one thing? I always eat with my mom. Really, yeah, me too. I'm gonna finish it now. Ah. Of all the ones that you've eaten. I should give you the bone. No, please. Ah. I will win. So, whenever I'm home, I like to eat with my mom. I like sharing food with my mom. So it just helps me eat better and I feel not just helping me eat better I just love to share food with my mom I just love it How about you? I've always been eating alone mm. I started sharing food when I got married <coughs> <laughs> mm. When you got married how about when we're dating? Are you always sharing food? Just now. Mm -hmm. Used to share. It's okay. Huh? Ah, we'll finish it. What's wrong with you? We'll start sharing food. Okay, what do we eat? Nice meal for a Sunday afternoon. Whoa! That was it. That was it. My husband likes going to the kitchen to wash his hands while, while I like using wash hand basin to wash my hands. So, there are individual differences. So, sometimes I go to the kitchen for what's this? Wash hand water. On the table i wash with the wash and water and then i go over to the kitchen to use soap to complete the washing and then clean my mouth thank you guys for watching if you watch up to this point you are the real 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 mvp okay subscribe share with your friends i love you bye